It's a rare call for law enforcement, but it's one that came in last night to authorities in Grimes County. A woman was in labor and was not going to make it to the hospital in time. News 3's Whitney Miller joins us now live in the studio to tell us about a trooper and a sheriff's deputy who stepped in and delivered Whitney quite literally. Yes, literally, Kristen. Their story has been spreading on Facebook, and it's one officers tell me doesn't happen very often. But when it does, they say they are well prepared. Basically, what was going through my mind is I was nervous. I'm not going to lie to you. Around 7 p.m. Saturday, Trooper Dylan Duke got the call that a Navasota woman was in labor at a gas station on FM2 and Highway 6. Duke says he was in the area, so he answered the call. When I got here, they had the woman. We put her in the back seat. We were on the phone with St. Joseph Communications the whole time, instructing me through it. The hospital operators walked him and Grimes County Sheriff's Deputy Stephen Syracusa step by step through the delivery process. We both relied on each other. Uh, we kind of helped each other as far as keeping her supported. Duke says that while he was nervous at the thought of delivering a child, he'd actually been trained to do so in the academy. And it's those skills he believed kicked into action. It definitely helped. I was able to stay calm, keep the her as calm as she possibly could. Baby Oscar Jr. was born at 7.19 p.m. Baby is happy, healthy. He's, he was a little screamer. He, he did he did excellent. He was awesome. You know, it, it was a blessing. This was a light to the darkness that's been going on recently. So this is definitely something that we needed. Now that picture Trooper Dylan posted has already been shared over 200 times on Facebook. For now, live in the News Center, Whitney Miller, News 3. Whitney, thank you.